morning guys welcome back to the channel and in today's little video on drones and days out we're going to be looking at Hetton Lions Country Park so there are three lakes here at Hetton Country Park and this one behind me is the fishing lake for anglers owned by the local fishing club and it uh, looks like they currently have a few anglers spending the day can't blame them, it's a lovely day around the lake sitting back relaxing, enjoying a bit of fishing So the reason for the lakes being here, it was a reclamation project back in the 1980s when this site had previously been part of Hetton Colliery which closed a lot earlier than the 1980s. Uh, however, as mining in general in the northeast was in decline, there was another pit operating called Eppleton Colliery just up the road, a little bit further up there and to be honest, when I was a kid I always thought all of the waste on this site here, there were huge big pit heaps of, sort of waste that was dug out of collieries and I always thought that was part of the waste from Appleton, however it wasn't, it was also part of Hetton Colliery's waste and it was just left here. Despite that, Hetton Burn, which you can hear behind me, was part of this area and we used to come over here as kids and collect things like frogs, tadpoles, the occasional stickleback and uh, slightly ashamed to say it, newts at the time. Um, obviously we didn't know any better back then. So once mining had closed down and left the area, this land was reclaimed and then it was re-landscaped into the park we have today. It has taken quite a while for it to establish itself, but now it looks pretty much as nature intended certainly in the smaller parts of the lake such as the fishing lake and this lake which we're going to see next So Blossom Lake is definitely a nature type of pond, it's, everything's left alone, it is managed but um, yeah it's pretty much left to all of the inhabitants to uh, do as they please.
So this is the Lions Lake and it is the biggest lake here. You also find most of the large birds on this lake including herons, ducks, geese, swans, uh, mohens and coots. It's also really popular with cyclists and joggers who do laps of the lake and um, yeah, walkers just like myself who just want to enjoy a bit of peace and quiet and some nice surroundings. Now we've got the colliery wheel there, little nod to the past, and without Hetton Colliery being on this site, mining in the northeast, certainly in the East Durham coal field, wouldn't have been anywhere near as successful.
So that's our little look around Hetland's Country Park. I hope you've enjoyed having a look around it too. If you have, why not give this video a thumbs up? And if you're not a subscriber to the channel, why not subscribe? And there'll be more days out, more drone flying, more time lapse videos, all sorts of stuff on here. So catch you in the next video. Bye for now.